All new at 10, it's typical to see cattle ranches across Texas, but what about antelope, gazelle, and buffalo? Eyewitness News reporter Holly Stouffer takes us to a ranch in Bee County with all of that. Hidden in the middle of South Texas is a little piece of Africa. Brian Gilroy takes us on a tour of his safari in Pettis. It's nearly 2,000 acres where wildebeest run. Got the attention of this one. And curious bongo peek between the trees. They look like dinosaurs. It kind of feels like Jurassic Park. There are locks and tall fences to keep these exotic animals safe. It's basically a bank protecting millions of dollars. So there are about 2,000 animals on this ranch that cover about 70 different species. Gilroy is the CEO of Wildlife Partners. He breeds and sells these animals to ranchers across Texas. Then they get tax breaks for giving them a place to thrive. These animals are living a very natural life. They cost anywhere from a couple grand to $200,000 a piece. That price tag will get you a big Cape buffalo. Gilroy says it's the most dangerous animal they have. A black death is what they call them in Africa. Gilroy says historically, this industry has been seen in a bad light. It's been viewed as canned hunting. While this does happen in some places, Gilroy says those aren't the type of ranchers they work but with. It, as far as our business goes, we are strictly selling to landowners that love breeding these animals and love looking at them. So how did a guy with a career in oil and gas end up being the king of the wild? This is my passion. Gilroy is first to admit money was the motivation, but he's also a conservationist. Who is this? This is an addict. A lot of the animals on this ranch, like this little one, are critically endangered. Or Gilroy's favorite, the Grevy Zebra. There's less than 3,000 of these left in the world. They can live on Texas soil without fear of predators or poachers in their very own circle of life. This is the Ritz-Carlton for critters. <laughs> in Pettis, Holly Stouffer, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News. Well, Gilroy has three young children who help out. We have pictures of them with the animals posted on our website, kens5.com. Interested buyers are able to visit this ranch, but you will have to go elsewhere if you're looking for a place to feed and pet exotic animals with your family.